we had another early, early morning today. Um, today is Jared and I's 16th anniversary. Uh, it's June 2nd and today we are going sapphire hunting in Montana. And I'm so excited. I hope we find a huge sapphire. while we look for sapphires, but we're not letting it rain on our parade. <laughs> They're explaining how to do our process. And here is their area. A little blue thing over there is the sluice. And they're allowing us to be in this space that's out of the rain, which I very much appreciate. <laughs> but yeah, we've already found a couple of very beautiful gems. So first Passover, we've already found like a really big, beautiful one I'm super excited about. And we haven't even really gotten started. Okay guys, ready? Yeah, this, one, this one's mine. Okay, this one's Holly's. Pull it off in the gravel for me. So okay, we, stop. we bought the kids a party bag option, which is what they're doing right now. So. It, it has, has some extra amethyst and citrine and some other fun things. Yeah, some bigger gems right, and stuff that the kids can pick through a little bit easier oh, than what our sapphire buckets wow. have. I need my dumb dad, I need my dumb dad. So yeah, there's hey. this bucket here and this bucket here is our sapphire Stop. bucket. Hang on, buddy. Leave it there. Oh, oh, oh. Already in there. Oh my gosh, what do you think, buddy? I think I found a sapphire. Oh. I, I don't think know this what is it the is. Thing I've done. Whoa. <laughs> the craziest thing you've done. I don't think that's true. <laughs> okay, I just did my cake flip. So this is the first thing of gravel that I've washed so far. So the sapphires are heavier than the rest of it, so it will like go to the bottom. You guys. Look, yeah, look at that. <laughs> So I'll put this guy in here. Oh. Oh. Try it. Put it right here. Look at the size of that sapphire. That's awesome. All right. What do you got in your your thing? I got a party Let's see. Ah, oh, dang, girl. Whoa, what? Wait a minute. Show me that one. Have a peridot in there? That's beautiful. Dude. I have, look at this one. It looks like one of the big crystals in the caves, but it's actually tiny size. Well, it's like, oh, you can't, okay. There we go. Wow. That's pretty lucky. So, this is what it looks like raw. We haven't even washed it yet. I can see this guy. Anyway. <laughs> They're more interested in the trucks that they provide for the kids. <laughs> At least they're entertained. All right, show us how to properly do this. Uh, getting all the sticks out of it right now. We washed it pretty good. Now we're gonna. They said the sapphires are heavier than the rock. Kind of like garnets. So we're just shaking it, giving all the stuff an opportunity to go to the bottom and the middle. Okay, now we're there. We'll just kind of give it a little it. shake. And then when we flip it, we'll flip it this way toward us. And then we're ready to go. All right. And if you watched our garnet video, um, the, the sluice was running consistently. This one's just still. All right, flip it like a cake, babe. And the uh, sapphire should be in the center. Oh, there's some. They look like glass. See it? Yep, right, right there. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna keep 
Diva sorted hers into piles of her finds. <laughs> Pretty, right? We're excited about that. And then so far, it's kind of hard to tell because they're kind of warm, but here's, oh, there's my sapphires. I even found a little pink one, which is super cool. So yeah, between Jared and I, we've got some good sapphire haul. We have been very successful so far, but the super awesome, let me set them down. In this one, I don't know if you can see, there's a giant one right at the top, and it's very, very blue. So we'll definitely get that one appraised. I didn't notice until one of the workers pointed it out, but this little sluice area is a giant G for Gem Mountain Sapphires. <laughs> you enjoying yourself? and this is probably going to be cuttable because I know we put one of those in there. So I'll take a look at this one first. 5.78? Yeah, so over five carats. What? Yeah. That's amazing. 5.78. That is so cool. Okay. Wow. Oh. Can you do this one? Yeah. Those are the pink so sapphires. Wow. What? what would you think of uncutting? So today's our 16 year anniversary. We had a lot of fun. We had so much fun. We are taking a break from the RV for one night because we drove to Montana to go sapphire hunting and we're spending the night in a hotel. So did you have a good day? It was a fun day. Well, tell me. <laughs> Just getting them. Hold on. Yeah, you can't, can't really see, see them. Hold on. So these ones are all of these small, flawed sapphires. Look at these. But pink yeah, sapphires. look at the pink ones. That one's super crazy. That's so cool. There's violet ones, pink ones, all that. And you know, these are all raw. None of them are heat treated, so they're not the deep blue color so, that you're used to sapphire seeing. There's kind of my hand for reference of size. Yeah, that's a good that's a good amount that we found. That's but 222 carats worth of sapphires. Sapphires. And then we come over to this guy. Look at here's our big guy. These are flawed, but still they can be, able cut. To be cut, but they have some flaws in them, but not enough to not be able to be made into a gem. So heat treat they can be heat treated and faceted into jewelry, but this big one that we found. 5.78 carats. 5 point. Oh yeah, there's there it is. For the big guy and the flawed ones. So all of these are um, over a carat minus that guy. That's way over a carat. But yeah, so totaling that is 21.95 carats for that. And then we've got these guys. Look at that. Pink, or is that that's violet, right? Not pink. That one's violet. Mm. That one's pink. So the cool thing about the pink ones is we'll show you when we get home because we have a black light at home. But the pink the sapphires pink ones, react. They are. They super duper glow. So we'll show you that. It's pretty awesome. But all of these are gem quality and almost every single one. I think the, I think the pink one is the smallest and you can see how much smaller it is than the rest of them. That one is three quarters of a carat. Mm -hmm. All of the rest of them are a carat or more. A carat or more. So, so yeah, all of these unflawed ones can be heat treated and made into some beautiful jewelry as well since they're all over a carat. Um, I think if I remember right, she's saying this one could be cut into like a perfect um, oval shape. But in total of all of our beautiful gems, we have 282 and a half carats worth of sapphires from our anniversary adventure today.